as the oxidation reaction of aldehyde and ketone in presence of the mild oxidizing agent, generally three types that can be represented by alkane like that. One is by tolerance. Another one is by fading reagent. And third one is the oxidation of methyl ketone by halophon. So oxidation of aldehyde and ketone in case of the uh, mild oxidizing agent that can be classified like that tolerance reagent by tolerance reagent by phoenix reagent and another one is the by halophone. And now I will discuss that another important reaction of aldehyde and ketone that is the reaction due to the alpha hydrogen. Uh, before going to the main part of the discussion, I will first discuss that what is called the alpha hydrogen. Now, as you know, the main functional group of aldehyde and ketone is the carbonyl, CO. Now, in case of the aldehyde, that one position will be hydrogen and rest of the positions will be either hydrogen or other substitute. Uh, I, I, am, I am taking a simple example of the acetaldehyde. Now what is called the alpha hydrogen with respect to that functional group just adjacent carbon is called alpha carbon and the hydrogen attached to the alpha carbon that is called alpha hydrogen. So number of the alpha hydrogen in case of the acetaldehyde is a 3 alpha hydrogen but thing is that that hydrogen which is directly attached to the functional group that is not called the alpha hydrogen. So in case of the formaldehyde, there is no alpha hydrogen because the both of the hydrogens are directly attached to the functional group that cannot be considered as the alpha hydrogen. Similarly, in case of the ketone, I am taking the simplest example acetone. In that case, the carbon which is directly attached to the functional carbonyl group that is called alpha carbon, here alpha carbon, two of the alpha carbons are there, so automatically number of the alpha hydrogen will be six. Now, what is the reason behind that reaction due to the uh, alpha hydrogen? That alpha hydrogen actually exhibits the acidic nature. Because due to the strong electron withdrawing group or electron withdrawing effect of the carbonyl group and resulting stabilization of the conjugate base, that alpha hydrogen exhibits that acidic property. How? If I take that example, that C double bonded O. Now, in presence of the base, that will be formed and that conjugate base will be the result stabilized. So, in that first case that when the alpha hydrogen is there that can be easily abstracted by that base and the conjugate base is the result stabilized. As you know, the conjugate base, if the conjugate base is the resonance stabilized, then also automatically the acidity will be higher. So, alpha hydrogen will be acidic in nature in case of the aldehyde and ketone. But we 